Hey, so, last episode for you guys was yesterday, but for me it's been about like a month or a month to a half since we've been in Mass Effect single player. Uh, I haven't been skipping out on Mass Effect entirely, I've been playing a lot of multiplayer. It's a, it's a pretty fun game mode. If you, if you have Mass Effect Andromeda, and if you have the, the single player, which of course you do, Thank you, Sam. Um, well, check out the multiplayer, you know? Even for one round, it's it's pretty fun. But I do believe we have to check in with the Avidus Rex guy after uh, looking at that lead on the Turian arc, and I don't think we found anything, so... Ryder, I was just about to call you. Everything all right? I've got numbers, coordinates, flashing in my head. I, I think it's an SOS from base. Oh, sure. That sounds interesting to do. Well, what I'm aiming to do this uh, this session is basically get everything that needs to be done right before we fight the big, uh, whatever the name of the cat loser is. <laughs> uh, where are we right now? Hey, eh? we're on Vold. Oh, there is something we we are. There is something we want to do on Vold, and that has to do with. Um, come on, I just want to grab there. Is it not letting me? What the heck? Okay, that's super weird. Let's, um, let's try again, alright? It's not letting me land on fold. That, that can be a problem. Let's, let's do this one more time. Ba -ba -ba -do. There we go. Okay. So, we have something to do with not PB or Jaws, so let's change PB out for Korra. Something to do with the Asari arc over here, so let's check that out. I have some weapons, I have some armor, let's go. Yeah, it's been about a few weeks to a month since patch 1.5 came out, or 1.0.5, or whatever it's called in that. Apparently that fixed a lot of the facial animations. I don't, I don't know. We haven't really spent that much time talking to a Allison or Anison or Addison, that's her name. Oof. Can you tell it's been a while? It's been a while. But yeah. Mostly been doing finals and then Mass Effect multiplayer. And then near. Lots of near as well. So I believe... We have to find the Periphona, or whatever that is. That shouldn't be too hard. A little bit of driving. Vold is overall a lot nicer of a planet ever since we fixed it. Let's go for a drive. Drive Effect Andromeda. My favorite game. Oh god, I'm going to have to get used to the... Uh, Gonna have to get used to driving again. Not super excited about that fact, but you know. We'll see. Yeah, thanks, Sam. I think one of the patch notes was like reducing how much Sam talks. I don't exactly know how much they've reduced his chattermouthness. But hopefully he's a little less annoying. Other than that, there were a few bug fixes. They made traveling between planets and galaxies a little faster, which is nice. Oh gosh, that's a lot of different objectives. Okay. Yeah. The reason I'm leaving this stuff in as opposed to most of the like mundane side quests I cut out is that it seems to be part of the loyalty mission for Korra, so we might as well get it done. Definitely going to record as 
hopefully all the loyalty missions. I was going to say as many as possible. If things work out well, then yeah, we'll record all of them. And everything's story-based, but a lot of the exploration and, you know, just driving around planets for hours, that ought to be cut out. Am I going the right way? I am. Okay, let's just leave a marker here just in case. Uh, I was messing around with the new... Yeah, thanks, Ryder. I was messing around with the new Legend of Zelda, actually. A few weeks ago, my uh, my sister has a Nintendo Switch, and... Obviously, I haven't devoted as much time to Legend of Zelda as Nier and Mass Effect, but, like... Ooh, that's a good game, eh? Thank you, Jal. There's a lot of ket here, I get it. You don't have to tell me three times. What's your combat disposition? Oh. Oh, so we're just driving around until we find false stuff? Okay, wait, no, I wanted to put a marker. Come on. Come on. I didn't get too far, though, before my Switch ran out of batteries. <laughs> I was playing it not plugged into the dock since my uh, sister was using the TV for something. This is at her apartment, by the way, so... I mean... I guess I could complain about battery life, but at the same time, it's a pretty powerful machine for its size, so... You know, not the best battery life is kind of expected. Especially on something with as much rendering as Breath of the Wild or the like. Usually Nintendo's pretty good at making additional iterations of a console to make it better, so... Maybe we'll find, like, the 3DS XL version of the Nintendo Switch someday. Does it really need to be bigger, though? I don't know. I uh, don't know. It's already pretty large. Uh, are we here, or is this the right place? Are we at the... We're, hmm. What is this? Yeah, okay. Uh, over here? Oh, okay. I would hope so. There's one over here, and there's one all the way over here. Who's gonna bet it's the very last one we see, huh? It always ends up like that. Always the last one we check. But yeah. I'm glad this is the only quest we have to do on this icy asshole planet. Then we can wash our hands with it for at least a while, right? Other than that, I think I've 100%ed most of the planets. Oh, hey. Boom! Oh, whoa, that was, that was great. That was, oh, we're in the shield. Oh, by the way, I, I changed my skills a little bit. Um, I respect overall, I had a lot of skills that was just in relatively useless, useless abilities, so I removed those points and put them in other stuff. Gun I'm using over here is the Revenant, which I think we showed off a little bit on the desert planet Elodin, right? It's, uh... The spread is pretty high, like it gets pretty inaccurate quickly, but it's pretty powerful, so I don't mind. A lot of damage per bullet, and it lays a lot of rounds down, so... What's up over here? S scan? Scan? Right? Scan. Oh, I just have to use it. Why don't they just let me use it without scanning? That's what I'm asking. Maybe the ship was the target. Oh, hey, D is capitalized. That means decimation is a proper noun. Okay. 
That could be good. Are we finally leaving Hoff? For once and for hold? Okay, so that's that's on hold, which means we have other things to do. Um, what did I want to go to? Did we want to wait for intel on the cat? Extra stuff. Origin of the single on the Nalash system. That's a I don't have to do that. But Turian Arc. We started on the Turian Arc, we might as well do Turian Arc stuff for a little bit. And though technically that is not a loyalty mission, I'm sure some of you are interested where it goes. You know, the Turian Arc, where it went, where it teleported off to, you know. I'm certainly interested. Turians are probably my favorite Mass Effect race. I mean, I've been playing nothing but Turian Soldier in Mass Effect multiplayer. That's a lie, I've been playing other classes, but Turian Soldier is, like, the most fun. <laughs> I don't think I do, but whatever. Oh, did we beat the on-hold part? Okay, so yeah, this is the main quest, which we will do in a little bit. Still have to do stuff on the weird pirate planet. I don't remember the name. And loyalty missions for Drac, Jal, and... Is that it? Drac and Jal? Hmm. I'll check the journal once we finish over here. So, where do we have to meet? Oh! Ark Natanis! Oh, lost but not forgotten. Does that mean all the Turians are dead? Let's hope not. I mean, all the Turians, all of them, clearly aren't dead. But, you know, if an entire Ark is lost, that means a lot of them are dead. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, that, that looks not great. Oof. Hey, Avidus. No oh, this got exciting. This is a little bit more interesting than just running around planets all day. Uh, let me change the loadout, please. Uh, yeah, I'll keep all those weapons. Upgrade to the Crusader. In multiplayer, this gun, this gun over here is actually broken. Like, it is kind of ridiculous how often it sees play in, you know, gold level missions. Let's see, um... We don't want Korra. Let's let's definitely run Vetra because she is a Turian. And then I don't know Liam. Sure, Liam and Vetra. Why not? Okay. Well, let's hope there's some survivors. This Mason guy is still alive. I mean, it's a bit like our arc, you know? Yeah, shut up, Sam. Oh, that would be useless. It's useful, not useless. Hey, it's 3 a.m. Give me a break, huh? Uh, can I open this? Okay. Is that door open? We we did skip over that door. Andromeda initiative. Hey, this door still got power. I wouldn't have been without Pathfinder. It leads to space. Perhaps you could divert the power to a different door. Oh, that's just what I was about to do, thanks. Uh oh, over there. This console looks about right. Oh, terminal, what's up? From Mason. So Mason was driving the thing. Mason. So Mason's talking to this captain or whatever. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, I also changed some of the settings so that all my crew members are always wearing helmets. It was a little weird that I was wearing a helmet and none of my crew was. So, 
Anyways, if you guys don't like that change, just let me know. But should be there for now. Makes more sense, right? Why wouldn't you wear your helmet out in space? Uh, cryogenic stability. Oh, wow. Okay. Do, do, do. Basic stuff. Nope. Are we going to find a second Sam? I don't think I can deal with a second one of them. Nagging me after every time I step into a warm and or cold area. Yeah, this is the definition of a ghost ship, though. Whoa. What is this? Debris? <laughs> Why would I get data for scanning debris? Seems a little useless. Dead plant. There's a console here. There we go. Does that close our first door? Or hmm. I like the design of the Turian helmets. Just overall, the Turian armor is pretty cool. Oh. Looks like Avi and Mason have way more history than I expected. I have a feeling that we're gonna find a, a not so alive Maven or Mason or whatever his name is. Usually these things don't end super well. What happens that way? So that means... Okay, okay, there's a container that I can't open. Never mind. Okay. Power. Power. Here? And that's this one, right? Nice. Okay. A second SAM node. How interesting. Their Sam sounds different. Yeah, it sounds way different than ours. Is did Sam like absorb Mason or something? What do you mean you sent the coordinates? Are you Mason now? Should have 
I don't know, that sounded pretty objective, Avidus. Avidus is going to be the Pathfinder, huh? Hmm, what's, what's his hesitation? I don't know. Hmm. Is this like an actual decision thing to make? Like... I think the Turians would be better off with the Pathfinder. I mean, the job was kind of forced on me too, in a way, right? Mason's dead, bruh. Your boyfriend is super dead, sorry. I guess we're at plus one Pathfinders. I mean, I'm pretty sure Avidus doesn't join our party and he goes and does his own thing, but... You know, that's one more than we had before, so... Good job, team. Um, I have emails, don't I, right? Asari Ark. Oh, we have to talk to Korra about the Asari Ark. Yeah, let's do that. And... What is this? Avidus Rex is leading a team to recover stasis pods from Ark and Tennis. He's certainly enthusiastic now. We'll have saved the lives of 15,000 Turians. Cool. What's this? Broken world, blah, 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 environment. Okay, nah. But I believe we have to talk to Korra, who is over in the plant bay, right? If I remember correctly. No, this is... Sorry, this is, uh, this is where Jal goes. Korra should be here, right? No. Okay, we're looking at the map. Gil, Vetra, Vetra, PB, Drac. Where is second floor, third floor? Cora. Okay. Yeah, and that's part of her loyalty mission. It says right on the map. Very good. Making some side quest progress. Yeah, I do definitely want to get all the loyalty missions done. If not for the sake of getting content in, for the sake of, you know, not killing everyone at the last mission. See, that's what happened to Mass Effect 2. If you didn't have everyone's loyalty mission done, you know, a lot of your crew would just die off. Hey, what's up, Korra? Hovering one foot above the ground. Looks like the patch didn't fix all the bugs. Very nice. Okay, well, we'll take a look. Sarissa's Cora's BFF, right? Yes, I would like to track that. We have a lead on it. We'll do it. Hey, Gil, what's up? Yeah, way more of a skeleton crew than Mass Effect 3 and 2, for sure. You had an entire, like, crew in the front. I just checked my email. Look, there's nothing. Leave me alone, Sam. You're broken. You're faulty. Okay, yeah, no, I was expecting enemies here, like, we'd fight a bunch of cat, but, you know. I suppose the situation was a little better than a bunch of cat, because if there were cat, everyone would absolutely be dead. This is a new system, right? That is 0%. I've explored most of the systems on my own time, and, yeah, there's certainly nothing to record. They're pretty boring, but you get materials, you get a little bit of lore. Okay, 
So we got a planet here. Anomaly. Bam. Arc Lucinia. That's an arc, alright. Wow, we're getting all these arcs done really quickly. Yeah, Korra has to come. Of course. And we'll, we'll keep Vetra for now. Vetra's cool. Well, the mission tracker did say arc. So I'm assuming it's an arc. Ceresa's anything like Mason. Well, I'm not holding out my hope for Ceresa's survival. That's an arc, all right. And a lot of scourge. Or stuff. What is the survival rate for Pathfinder colonists? I mean, most of the humans got here, but the Asari took a hit. The majority of Turians are definitely dead. I don't know. Okay, we're here. Dock with Arthasinia. Reach the bridge. Oh, they're letting me draw guns. Debris, debris. Hello? Anyone? We're here to help. I don't hear anyone. Hmm. Can't open that door. I, mean, I hope at least we find some survivors. Die, you kid monsters. Oh! What? what? That's one more survivor than we found on the Turian arc. There's that Nash navigational hollow display and stuff there. Hey, I'll take research data whenever I can get it. Atrium! This area saw combat action. No body. Hmm. Pretty good point, Cora. I mean, it still doesn't look as bad as the Turian arc, so. Eh. But you'd a Pathfinder team hey, Sarissa is alive. Yes, we can't take any more chances. <clears throat> Sarissa Theris, Pathfinder. Don't mind the captain. Scolding me. But, but she's dead, huh? The actual Pathfinder. Are all the original Pathfinders dead? Like, my, my dad's dead, Mason is dead, and Matriarch is dead, so... Did the Salarians have a Pathfinder? I think Solarian Arc would be the last one after this one. The Krogans didn't have an arc, from what I believe. Decimation Hunters. They're a cat on board? Like, right now? We'll probably have to shoot them. 
Hmm. Honestly, I think data would probably be useful against the Ket in the long run. We gotta shoot the Ket, huh? Sounds like a plan. The last commando report came from hangar control. I'll give you access. Please be careful. Hey, if I'm good at anything, it's shooting lots of cat in the face. Lots of times. Well, I have no idea what this decimation patrol could be. I mean, you only get a limited amount of enemy types in multiplayer. <laughs> Mason? Yeah. You know, I, ho I hope at least the Solarian Pathfinder is still alive, the original one. It'd be awkward if, like, all the new Pathfinders were just a bunch of babies holding guns, because that's what it feels like right now. What is this? Blah blah blah. Seal all doors. Blah blah blah. Okay. Guns ready. Hmm. Okay, okay. Whoa, hello. I mean, made it is a bit of a stretch, but... I guess they are having a lot of casualties, huh? They can survive in vacuum? Probably has to do with that weird, like, moldy skin stuff they have. Wow. Korra is, like, the definition of by the book. Hey, you think we're gonna fight anything here, huh? Think that a that ammo box isn't conspicuously placed?